10 random gaming facts in 2 minutes, part 1. Number 1. The voice actor of Master Chief from every Halo game is in fact a famous DJ named Steve Downs, dating back to the late 70s. 2. We all know and love the Batman Arkham Asylum game, but in early development it was originally going to be a rhythmic action game, but both failed attempts at it basically fueled the final combat system. 3. Before Xbox was the final name, it was originally going to be called Direct Xbox, basically being a PC with hidden Windows OS that would be marketed like a console. Luckily for us, during development, everything changed including the look and Xbox became the thing. 4. Weirdly, in 2001, the UK versions of FIFA 2001 and Gran Turismo 2 came with scratch and sniff discs. With FIFA, you could smell the pitch, and GT2, you could smell an authentic pit stop. But smelling rubber is not the thing you often want to do though. 5. You may not know unless you're a Halo superfan, but comedians Conan O'Brien and Andy Richter went to 343 Industries for a spoof skit where they recorded some lines. It actually made it into Halo 4, the level is shut down, and you've got to stand next to two specific dock workers for a few minutes to hear the lines. 6. The origins of Lara Croft is an interesting one. Originally, core designer animator Toby Gard wanted a male looking for treasure, but got big Indiana Jones vibes. He switched it to a South American woman named Laura Cruz, but Toby wanted a UK friendly name, so went with Lara Croft. 7. Assassin's Creed was never actually meant to be Assassin's Creed. It was meant to be another Prince of Persia game, but after a year of development, they canned the idea as it didn't focus on the prince enough, somehow. So that is where the Assassin's Creed game was born. 8. In the very first Civilization game, Gandhi's aggression meter was the lowest, meaning no war. But if a player chose democracy, Gandhi's aggression points would drop by 2. But instead of it being minus 1, it looped around to a tasty 255, basically turning Gandhi into an all-out maniacal, angry-ass titan. 9. Ever wonder why there's barely any humans about in Super Mario? On the NES, there was a short story basically explaining that the Koopas turned humans into block stones and plants. So, next time you jump on a block, rendering in it pretty dead, you've just accidentally killed someone. Fuming! 10. If you've played Fallout 3, you'll have fired the Fat Man nuke. But ever wonder where that little ding, not little dong, that's for another story, comes from? It's actually just from Bethesda's Lunch Bell Cafeteria, and it is as simple as that. Thanks for watching, make sure to like, comment and subscribe, Legends on Patreon, thanks for supporting the channel constantly, and I'll see you soon for some more random gaming facts. Big love!